Okay, here's something that you may start to get sessions this way and you'll be like, whoa, I've never seen Pro Tools do this before. For all its heads, there's a, a little common thing that's been, been known for a while. One of the programmers uh, who originally came up with the program, I'm gonna turn this on, it has to do with making these whole tracks, full colors, it's blow your mind. Mix window, track color, so we get our little indicators. Remember if we double click on the color down here, up pops the color palette and we can change the track to a different color if we want okay let's change this one to orange okay so now that we got that and we got this turned on if you hold down control option and apple the same way you can click on faders and make them fat if you hold down control option and apple and scroll up in the color palette you turn the opacity of, of these faders all the way up from totally gray to all the way up. So to full colors, this is kind of cool if you're dealing with like a lot of tracks. You can label them and just when you're scrolling from left to right, you can see them real easy. But this is something that's going around that the new, newer generations got a hold of. And you may see something like this and you'll be like, well, how did they do that? Now you know. Touch a knob, make a sound with me, Bobby Brooks. Peace.